Hey guys, and today I want to do a quick review on the Ethanex 45. Um, let me show you it's empty first. See it's empty. No bullets in it. Magazine's out. Okay. Uh, the Ethanex 45 is made by FNH USA. And it's a stainless, this particular one is stainless steel, with a stainless steel mat made in the USA, um, Fredericksburg, Virginia. Uh, the FNX, the FNX 45 is a 45 ACP, and it takes a 15 round magazine and has witness holes. It's double stacked. The gun itself has removable back straps right here that you can remove. Uh, it does have a lightened hammer as you see that. Uh, the gun also has dual magazine releases, AMBI magazine release, some people call it. It does have AMBI safeties. See? Nice side. It has a ambidextrous, also ambi decocker, so you can decock it down. The gun you can also carry it cocked and locked, sort of like that, and it won't fire. But then when you're ready, you drop it and you can fire it. It is full double action. Um, this particular one has a polished barrel and some internal parts. Uh, they do not come with night sights. These are night sights that I actually put on. These night sights uh, are Trijicons, but they normally come with just a white sight, just white dots. It does also have a dual slide release and the slide lock. However, you only lock it on one side. But the release you can also release on this side and knock it down. Uh, the gun itself takedown is fairly easy. You push the gun down like that. This button here you press down. You actually just slide it back. They recommend you decock it and then pull it off. Uh, getting down to the business end of it, this is the internal of it. It comes with a metal guide rod from the factory. The barrel, this particular one like I say was polished a little. This is your barrel. Okay, and here's your slide. The recoil spring, we'll put that back in. Slide right down. Very easy to put it back together. Here's the frame of the gun itself, as you can see. The tecocker kind of just works like. If you look up here, you can see how it decocks it down. See that? That drops the decocker, drops the uh, hammer. It is a firing pin, it is not striker fire. Uh, if you'll notice on the gun itself, the rail here, see that? You'll see that it's metal in here also for the slide rail, for the put the slide on there. It does come out. It is, re, you know, replaceable. This one here I polished out a little. Um, the gun itself is very well made. It has a rail here for lights or lasers or whatever you want to put in. Putting it back together is pretty much the same thing. Make sure you slide it on. You lock the rail. Slide back with that. Drop it. And then you can go ahead and drop it. The nice thing about it, this gun holds 15 rounds. Uh, there's a lot of other guns around on the market, but you'd be very hard pressed. Now, if you didn't have the actual target sights on, I mean the night sights in a polished barrel, you could probably get this gun for about six and a half. If you looked around, you could probably get it for about six. Um, just about the price of, you know, it's a little bit more than about a hundred bucks more than a Glock, but it's much more gun. It's a lot better. The uh, the design of it and you know all the features on this gun is just out of the box awesome 
and uh, it'll, like I said, it'll take light rails. This is from a Glock. Pop it right on there, you know. Or you can actually put a laser on there or whatever you do. I also have a laser that um, looks something like this that I can put on there too. I don't think they make a guide rod laser for this. Come off, it's pretty simple. And then if you want to put that on there, pretty straightforward. And you have a laser with a light. A little bit of both. So it's kind of neat. So it, it really depends on, you know, uh, how you want to uh, accessorize the gun for your defensive uh, situation. But like I say, you can do single pull trigger like that. And it has a little plastic stop there, you can see. Let me back there. When you shoot, that's a stop. Try to hold it. Get it well to reset. See that little stop? And it's a stop there. But, you know, like I say, the gun is very well made. Uh, the FNX feels great in my hand. And I wanted to show you that. Once again, that's the FNX 45, which uh, takes this massive 45 caliber bullet and 15 rounds. You really can't go wrong with this gun as far as for home defense. Um, if you can carry it, you know, it's a big gun. Carry, target, range, really has all the features. I don't, you'd be pretty hard pressed to want any other gun than this for especially home defense and target shooting. Thanks a lot and uh, I, thought, I hope you enjoyed the video and please subscribe and leave a comment.